Okay, this is how we calibrate an AgTech sprayer. First of all, we need to know our desired gallons per acre. So for the sake of argument, let's say we want to do 30 gallons per acre. Second, we need to know our row width. So let's say our rows are 10 feet. So we're doing 30 gallons per acre at a 10 foot row width. So we move 30 over 10. Now that gives us our gallons per minute per meter. Next we need to know how fast we're going to be going while we're spraying. So let's say, again for the sake of argument, we're going 3 miles an hour. So this gives us 0.9 gallons per minute per meter at 3 miles an hour. So we take that 0.9 gallons per minute per meter up here, plug in 0.9, That gives us, at 20 to 25 pounds of pressure, 6 on the meter. So, we move over here to our sprayer. These are the metering discs. They have numbers, which I will grab one and show you. They are numbered. The holes have different sizes. This is a big hole, small hole, see that? These numbers correspond to different holes. So we had a number six. So we would take our meter, put it on six, and tighten it down. Now that's a very small hole. I don't know if you can see that through there. But that's metering your spray material. And it's the same concept, it's just it's the same thing on this. As the water comes through here, it's metered out to the proportion that it needs to be, and it comes through here and goes out the spray head. And that's how you calibrate an Agtech sprayer.